If you have loaded variable rate prescriptions into your 2630 monitor but are having trouble finding them in the monitor and think that they didn't transfer, make sure you're going back to your documentation button, hit your RX, and they may not be showing up in your drop down here. That may be what the confusion is. They're in the monitor, just not showing up. So they may be stuck in this shape file button. So we need to convert it for the monitor to be able to recognize the prescription itself. So if you hit the shape file here, here is a long list of prescriptions that I have loaded into the monitor previously, but they have not been converted into a usable prescription file for the 2630. So what you're going to do, you will walk through and we're going to do this option right here. You can change the name of the prescription that was imported if you want to, add the year to it if you have other prescriptions, add the product name if you have multiple products for the same field, and then you're going to tell it what you want that unit column to be that the prescription is coming from. So with this one, there's multiple target rates, but I'm going to hit the one that says target rate and it looks like a one. It's target rate pounds. And then I'm going to tell it what I want my out of field rate and what my loss of GPS rate to be. So you can change that. And once we've got those values changed, then we're going to start the conversion process and hit accept. So the monitor will now start to convert that shape file. Once it's successful, it will show you a summary of the prescription data and show you a map if everything looks correct to the as applied map that you were given, then you can hit accept. And it will now be available in your drop down so that you can select that and variable rate a product in the field in your with your 2630.